it is early. I'm going to the gym, vlogging on my phone. Oh good, okay, we're in the elevator alone. Um, yeah, it's earlier than I've gotten up this whole time. I got up at like 7.30, so it's not that bad, but I'm used to getting up at 8 for class. Um, yeah, looking a bit dead, but I'm definitely gonna feel better after I work out. when I'm working out but if you're new here and haven't seen my face my name's Emma welcome to my channel and today oh there we go <laughs> and I'm kind of just gonna be doing a like weekend in my life in New York we don't have any classes today and it's technically a Friday but like I said we don't have any classes so I count it as the weekend and yeah so today on the agenda we have Junior Junction first which is where we kind of talk college apps with some of the like Barnard admissions people i'm not sure what we're going to talk about today we talked a lot about college apps last week and then we have kind of a general meeting i think they're just going to reiterate the rules but we shall see and yeah and then i have the met later today i'm so excited for the met so yeah started off the morning right worked out and now let's go to breakfast and get our day actually started we'll keep on pushing anyway After leadership in action I don't even think I filmed in there I don't remember last time I filmed I'm so tired if you can't tell we all were just in that room and we were like this is great but we're too tired so I'm just gonna kind of rest on my bed sorry one of my friends just knocked but yeah I'm gonna rest read my book pretty good so far I haven't made any book videos lately but I've been reading a lot, so once I get home and everything's normal, I'll definitely talk a lot about what I've been reading. But for now, I'm gonna rest, and then we're gonna go to the Met! I'm so excited, I've actually never been before. So it's gonna be great, I'm excited. But for now, rest, and I will catch you guys sometime before we leave. <laughs> It's just so nice. It's not like totally hot and sweltering, and so I'm just trying to enjoy it. Soak it all in. Stayed so in the like so a... far away. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my god. Okay, wait, we gotta wait, actually take you to spend cool all day. Here. Tell me <laughs> yeah. I really could.
so like wonderful up, The star could make the sun as bright as you Even the dark they still see light Even the birds still sing at night Every word just comes out right When I'm with you, with you I feel so lucky I met you And I still can't believe that I get to see those eyes from more than tonight. I swear you must have felt from the sky. And I in that case. feel yeah. um, so lucky I met you. It's not logical. The way I feel when you walk in the room. Mm -hmm. When you walk in the room. It's not optional. It's not optional. How gravity just pulls me right to you. Even the birds still sing at night Every word just comes out right When I'm with you, with you I feel so lucky I met you And I still um, can't believe that I get to See those eyes from more than tonight I swear you must have felt from the sky And I feel I met you. Spent my whole life waiting for someone like you, baby. And all these broken. Hey, I haven't caught up with you guys in a bit. Um, so we had the Met last night. It was super cool. Oh my god, that was the first time I've ever been, and I was in love. There was no way we had enough time. Like I would love to spend just a whole day there, but it was amazing. And then got back I was exhausted because I had gotten up like you saw to work out and I was gonna try to go to bed but then I had some kind of like conflicts with figuring out what I was doing today I was gonna go to bookstores with friends but it just didn't end up working out so now the updated plan is I'm gonna go to one of the bookstores that is like inside what they call the expanded perimeter which is like where we can go on weekends and then I'm going to go to Central Park and just kind of chill and read and then my friends and I planned a thrifting excursion later tonight. So that's the plan for today. Obviously subject to change, things can happen. But yeah, I'm excited. Um, I haven't been to Central Park since being here just because we've been so jam packed with like all the things that are planned. But I've been going to all the excursions that the program plans, but I'm gonna miss one today just because it's also a museum and like I said I just went to the Met and I <laughs> I don't know I don't really think you can beat that and I'd also just wouldn't mind a free day but yeah that's the update I'm going to finish putting on this sunscreen and then put my shoes on pack my stuff I think I'm gonna bring my computer just so I can work on my book um and then I'm gonna put my laundry in because apparently the laundry machines are like not gonna be available to use um, next week. So I'm just gonna try to get like a bunch of it done now. And then I will head out. So I'll take you guys along. Happy Saturday, I'm excited. I just love having free time. Everything's been so fun, but now I just get to like kind of do my own thing. But yeah, I'll see you guys when I start moving roses led to you spend my whole life waiting for someone like you baby and all these broken roses led to you i feel so lucky i met you and i still can't believe that I get to see those eyes from more than tonight I swear you must have felt from the sky And I feel so lucky I met you
run it back If we could run it If we could run it back And do you wanna If we could run it back I'm filming this 
segment on my phone because I'm in Central Park. Excuse the angle, but I finally got done with all of the bookstores. So we have a little bit of a bookstore haul. Keep in mind, I have not spent money like since being here. So this is my first time like actually buying stuff. I've had to buy like food and things when um, the dining hall closed, but other than that, I really genuinely like haven't spent money. So that is why I use this as an excuse to get a bunch of books. Now I'm gonna show you what I got. So I've been eyeing this book for a while. It's been on my to read list. This is the one new one I got. I just think it sounds really good. And yeah, I got this one from Strand. So I went to the Strand on the Upper West Side because I'm in Central Park on the Upper West Side right now. And it was closer to the first bookstore that I went to than like the other Strand location. So I just went there and then I also got this huge tote bag because I have a habit of just like shoving stuff in tote bags and the pre-college tote bag they gave us is not gonna lie, pretty tiny. So, large tote bag. I love it, very epic. People are out and about. Um, Okay, and then I went to probably my favorite. This is the first one I went to that you saw in the clips. Um, West Sider New York Books. And I got this book called The Ebony Tower by John Foles. I mostly just like looked around for the ones that I thought looked good and then I like looked them up on Goodreads to make sure I knew like the plot and stuff. And so I thought this one sounded good. So I got this. And then I also got The Pathfinder by James Fenimore Cooper. I also thought this sounded interesting. I don't remember exactly what this one was about, but like I said, I kind of just looked up all the summaries. And then this was a little bit of a impulse buy, but I it was it's like a little travel book by and it has all these different pictures of places like Vienna. Um, I think yeah, Berlin. I definitely an older book. Like all of these are vintage or used. Um, and I just thought it was really pretty with the pictures and stuff. And I love travel, so I like this one. And then last but not least, I got. Wharton novellas and other writings, just like some short stories by, I believe, um, Edith Wharton, so her, yes, um, by her. And I am excited to read this as well because I've never actually read anything by her. So yeah, that is my haul. I'm now probably just going to sit here and read the book that I have right now so I can start reading these. And yeah, just kind of relax and take it all in, do some people watching. So I'll catch you guys later. I'm feeling alright. I could be a sunshine. Not gonna stop until we collide. I could be a sunshine. just read but it said it's gonna thunderstorm and my friends and I also have to go or we're going to go thrifting tonight so I have to go back but yeah it's saying it's gonna thunderstorm and it really does look like it so I'm gonna try to get back on the one and go back uptown at least for a little bit and then we'll see what we end up doing don't you ever dare turn this car
so good Grew up in the same neighborhood Clouds had a rough second Spend a few hours on the reservoir Never broke a bone so I'm gonna try hard To prove you wrong
they say If I just met you Everything's gonna start somewhere It's gonna start somewhere Before you can kind of see it. Ah, hello.